welcome to the vlog. Happy Thursday. So before we get into it, I want to do a fun Yvette Sports try on haul and review. Yvette Sports, I've talked about so many times, so chances are you're familiar. If not, they sell activewear, uh, sports bras, leggings. They do sell pullovers and all that sort of fun activewear things. They also do a pretty decent plus size range. I believe they go from extra small yeah extra small to 5xl i'm just looking at my notes to make sure i get it right cups a through f so i own a ton a ton of yvette sports and a lot of y'all have reached out and said that you've ordered and you really love it so they did send me these items to try on for the video but we're going to take it a step further so i'm going to show you what they look like today and then in the morning i'm going to do a workout and we're truly going to test them out so i have the high impact bras that are meant to do higher impact workouts. I feel like Yvette Sports does a great job with all range. So low impact or like low support, medium support, and high support. The low support ones, I'll link my favorites down below. I wear those just like on an everyday basis around the house. Medium support ones I feel like are really good for yoga or Pilates or like a stretching type workout and then the high support ones which i'm going to show you today the new ones are really really good for running or uh, jumping um those sort of like higher impact workouts so all of the items you're going to see in this video range about 30 bucks a piece which is a phenomenal deal for the quality i'm telling you that because i believe it 100 percent the quality of these items is really really good not just for the price but really good in general i do have a discount code as well so taryn 15 will save you 15 percent off of your purchase taryn 20 will save you 20 percent off of orders 109 dollars or more all this information i'll link down below i'll also leave yvette sports instagram down below i get a lot of questions on sizing and they do a really good job over on instagram of answering your questions kind of helping you based on your measurements and other items that you wear helping you figure out what size you think you may need so i am wearing i'll list everything on the screen as you're looking at it but i'm wearing a 3xl plus slash 3XL D through F in the bras, and the leggings are in a size 2XL, which comes out to a US size 14. I am not a size 14. I'm a size 20 or a 22, but these fit me really well, and they don't stretch to a point where you can see through them, which I love. Okay, let's do the bra first. So this is the Sculpt Racerback Women's High Support Bra. It's this really pretty black with the blue detail here the little Levette, Yvette sports logo here it has this like mesh or cool max I think is what they call it yeah cool max technology to make it a little bit more breathable I love the scoop ratio neck to chest here I feel like this is just enough breathing room for me it does fit really really well I'll turn around in a second and show you the back um the sides everything about it fits good this they call high support it fits really well and here's what we look like from the back so it is a true racer bag and then it's got these adjustable clasps here i just hooked it on the last one and i feel like that is a good size for me then we have these leggings so i knew they were different the minute that i felt the fabric so these are part of their sustainable eco-friendly line of leggings so these again are in a size 2xl fit really well I love the thick band here and it really just compressions and sort of sucks everything in. I'm wearing super dark underwear and you cannot see through these whatsoever, despite the fact that they have stretched quite a bit because again, they're a US size 14 and I'm not a US size 14. I really like the fabric of these. I feel like these could be obviously great for working out, but also just for lounging or wear with a big t-shirt and some sneakers because it is this super soft material. And here's what they look like from the back, the little logo on the side. These also, by the way, come in four colors. Okay, next one we have is the Limitless High Support Sports Bra. This is high support. This beautiful color too, I wonder what it's called. It doesn't have like a name on the website, you can just select the color. Okay, here we go. This is definitely high impact. Like I'm in here, and I love the adjustable options with this one. So online it says nine, nine adjustable 
like level options, strength levels, that's what they call them. So on the back, I'll turn around and show you in a second, you can adjust that back there. You've got these like little side adjustables here. You've got the zipper in the front. I love the zipper. I also love that it's got a little piece of fabric here to cover that so it doesn't irritate your skin right there. So here's what it looks like from the back. So these actually have like little hooks that you can, if you need it tighter, looser, all these down here, you can select if you needed to switch it out. I'll put a picture here on the screen of like all the adjustment levels that you can do. Shoulder straps, chest band. I like these again because you're ordering a certain size in a bra, but then you can also go in and customize it to your body. Plus this color is really pretty. So they're mesh leggings. I don't own any like this. Like this is the first time that I've gotten some sort of different leggings like the eco-friendly ones and then these with the mesh. Again, the super thick waistband is high. I like that. It really tightens everything in. There is a string here on the inside too if you needed it even tighter then you can do that. I love the length of these. The mesh I think is so cute. And here's what they look like from the back. That thick band extends all the way around. I like this one. <laughs> okay, these straps right here, they're like super elastic straps. Can you tell? That are adjustable in the back. So this is called the Power Back Adjustable High Support Running Sports Bra. So it's a black color. Has this cool Max Technology fabric here, little logo on the side. This one fits really, really nice as well. So you can see these like I was talking about. I was able to adjust them. I love all the crisscross. It also has this clasp here on the back. This one's nice. Okay, I really like this one. I don't own any from Yvette that have this sort of elastic band here, and it just feels really, really nice. Like I feel like it's got enough room in it so it doesn't dig, plus you've got the adjustable option that it just feels really, really nice. Also, you can't beat a solid black. You know, it sort of goes with everything. Good morning, welcome to Tuesday. So I have lower body today with my trainer. I chose these leggings because the texture is just so different again. Plus they're lighter leggings, so we'll be able to tell, are they sweat proof? We know they're not see-through, but that sort of thing. And then I chose this uh, strappy back one because these straps here are so different than any of the other ones I own. So I felt like trying each, like something, a, a bra and leggings that like I'd never, like something different about them that I hadn't had before would be a good idea. So here's the outfit for today. <laughs> y'all okay that was hard that was really hard it's like when you look back and you're like oh it wasn't that bad but while you're in the process it was really bad okay so I have no complaints leggings are still not see-through I feel like there's a little bit of sweat right here um but nothing that like I'm upset about there might be a little bit at the top back there as well but remember too these are also their like eco-friendly line they're a little bit different of a material. Sports bra held up great. Absolutely great, no complaints. I even felt like when I was doing those like hip razor thingies on the ground, they my chest didn't come up to my neck, which is a bonus. Like this bra kept them in the place that they needed to go. Okay, I'm gonna go take a shower and get ready and do other things. Again, all the links to everything I tried on is linked down below. Whew, that was hard. Okay, so let's get into the regular weekly vlog.
Good morning. Happy Thursday. It's probably 9, 10. Am I right? It's on the screen. Am I right? I don't know yet. Uh, so I finished my workout this morning. Cash and I went on a little car ride. I needed to get gas because today my mom and I are going to ride over to Dolphin Island. It's probably like 30 minutes, so it's not far, but it's literally its own island. So I just like to have gas. Not that they don't have gas stations, <laughs> but you know what I mean? Like, I just like to be prepared. So she's going to help me take some pictures and videos of some really cute swimsuits. They may be up by the time that you're watching this. If so, I'll link the video down below. If not, it's coming soon. Um, so we're going to do that today. And hopefully she will let me vlog. <laughs> me and her, I'm telling you, laugh until we almost pee our pants when we like shoot together and stuff. So I'm gonna like just set up the camera in the car and see, <laughs> see if she notices, see if she's okay with it. That's what I should probably say, see if she's okay with it. Um, so we're gonna do that today. I'm doing laundry, what else? There was something else I was gonna tell you that I was doing today. Oh, we went to get gas. I had to go to the bank. So my banking app, I'm sure everybody can do this from the app where you can deposit checks. For some reason this morning, it told me that I had to have a business account. Excuse me. I'm just little old me. I'm just trying to deposit my little checks <laughs> into my checking account. So uh, Cash and I rode to the bank and deposited that check. So that's the plan. I'm going to take a shower, put on some makeup because I am taking pictures, but I'm not gonna do a lot. It's kind of chilly outside today but it's gorgeous. Today's actually the only day that it's nice outside. So Brian and I were actually gonna shoot on Monday of this week, these swimsuits, he was gonna go with me, but it poured down rain all day long. And obviously I want like pretty pictures. So today, Thursday is the only day on the weather app for Dolphin Island that it's gonna be sunny. So my mom's supposed to be here at 12. I do have a couple of dresses. So I think I have five swimsuits and two dresses. I need to steam the dresses. I'm excited though. I haven't seen my mom in a while, so we'll have a good time. And plus, people talk about this restaurant over there called Shaggy's maybe, that's supposed to be really good. I also got me a coffee. I'll see you in the car, hopefully, with my mom. Here they come. All right, so I need to go, Let's just go left. Let me see what happens. Here. There's no cars this way. Yep. Well, I can't see, so I'm just going to wait. All right. You know, we maybe should go that way. I see the interstate right there. Okay. So and we're going to go right. Show. We're going to go right. We're going to go right. Hello, by the way, Cookies to the vlog. Cream. Okay. <laughs> My mom's giving me directions to get to Dauphin Island. We're heading. This says we're going to Mobile. That's the way we need to go. Oh, okay, okay, okay. She looks super cute in her outfit. Hi, so hey we're gonna everybody. take we're gonna take some fun pictures. People ask about you all the time. I should have asked them to ask questions so you could answer them. Well, that's okay. Everyone always asks how you're feeling. I'm feeling very good today. You look good. You look cute. Uh, what else? People always say, "Hmm, how you're feeling? Hope you're well." Sort of thing. Yes, I'm better. I'm about to start back going to work again. Mm-hmm. Looking forward to that, being home. You never thought you'd say pandemic. looking forward to going to work, huh? Mm -mm. <laughs> a whole year home with nobody around. Half of it you're sick. It's boring. It's boring. She's also going to film that uh, funny Instagram reel video. Mm -hmm. Her first time ever. You do have Instagram, though. But you just don't really get on it that often. Mm-mm. Oh, people always ask about your hair, too. It's growing back. And I always say, yeah. do I need to stay over here? We're going to turn up here. Oh, okay. I always say, where do you think I got all this hair from? <laughs> she got it from me. Mm-hmm. Mine just all fell out, but it, I promise you it's coming back full and thick and curly. I've been trying to talk her into, how many times have I said to you, grow it long so you can put it in a bun? my life. She's only ever had short hair my entire life. So I want her to grow it long. Don't turn you. Don't turn you. So she can put it in a bun on top of her head. But. I don't know. We'll see. All right. We made it to a place called Pirates. Mom says it's really good. <laughs> so we're going to try it out. Look how pretty though, the water. I wonder what all these used to be. Huh. 
Okay, I think I'm gonna get the shrimp basket for lunch. Hey, we hadn't vlogged again hey. <laughs> since the restaurant. I showed him what I was ordering. Uh -huh. So we've done quite a few outfits. Three swimsuits. Yes. Two dresses. We have two more swimsuits. Um, and we're waiting because the ferry is unloading. <laughs> and loading now. Yep. But it's so nice out. I could live out here. So nice. It's very pretty. I'm home, showered, skincare, in my PJs. It's like 6.30, I just ate a banana. Hey, did you have a good day? Do you smell the banana? You were so sweet. I did pull out some chicken for dinner. <sighs> Will I cook the chicken? I don't know. I wanna do something different with it. So we always do, or I always do just like grilled chicken in the air fryer and it's so good. But we do that pretty often, so I need to figure out something else to do. But we got so many, so many cute pictures and stuff today. I looked through the footage to see if there was, uh, like, any bloopers or anything to include. There was really not. So, sorry about that. I should have remembered to just, like, screen record everything that we do, but I didn't. Um, but we did decide that we're going to make it, make it more often that we do this Dolphin Island trip because I think it's like 45 minutes from my house to the beach in Dolphin Island and that's that was with traffic and everything today not quite 45 minutes so we're gonna do it more often so now I'm gonna figure out what I'm gonna do with this chicken so we've made the decision to do the chicken with some pasta so we have these spinach and ricotta and mushroom raviolis. And then we're gonna use this tomato basil. Someone actually recommended this in my, maybe a couple of videos ago when we got the Williams Sonoma pasta. Uh, someone said this one was really good. This is the second one that we've tried. So the first one I think was like a garlic and it was really good. So that should be good. The red sauce with the pasta and the chicken. So I'm gonna chop this up or not chop it up. I'm gonna cut the like skin, whatever's on it, the fatty stuff off, season it, and then throw it in the air fryer so it'll get a little bit crisp. Okay, so here's the final product. Looks good. Lots of chicken. Smells good. We're gonna eat dinner. Good morning. Happy Friday. It is, I'll tell you what time it is, 9.25-ish. So obviously I just got out of the shower. I did my workout this morning. We're five weeks in. I can't believe it's been that long already, five weeks. Um, so I showered. I have some fun videos I want to film today. So yesterday I did the beach stuff with my mom. So I need to like film the sit down part of that video. And then I also want to film a fun style Saturday. I found the funnest, in my opinion, the most fun like video styling video. So I'm excited for that. Um, and that's the plan. I'm doing a little bit of laundry. I'm gonna make me some breakfast. The tomato basil, sorry, you couldn't even see my face. The uh, tomato basil sauce from last night, delicious. So good. Um, the pasta, not my favorite. If I'm gonna do like stuffed ravioli, I would rather it just be like stuffed with cheese. But you know, Brian enjoyed it. Also, this is how much I love those waters. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna do some toast this morning. I don't have any like bacon cooked. The last time I cooked it, I ended up like over the next few days eating all of that. We do have some Koneka sausage, but I might, you know what? I might cook it. Okay, change of plans. I in fact don't have any Koneka sausage thawed, but I do have the rest of this bacon. So I think I'm just gonna do this. And that'll, you know, I can eat some obviously this morning, tomorrow morning. Like it'll last me and then I won't have to cook again. And yes, it is extra thick. Someone commented like a couple of vlogs ago like, oh, that looks like some thick bacon. It is the super like extra thick bacon. Here's an updated look at the pool liner. So I mentioned they came back because there was a couple ripples, the pool's uneven, blah, blah, blah. We know that. 
Um, so now it's just getting filled back up, but I'm obsessed. I'm so happy that we went with this. Can you see my shadow? I have a blanket on and a coffee. Y'all, I've been sitting here working all day and just realized I haven't even said anything. It's 4.10. Um, I filmed my couple of videos. I'm editing one of them now. My sister is dropping off my nieces. It's her and her husband's anniversary. So I'm going to keep the girls tonight. We don't have anything fun planned. We're just, I'm going to work while they probably watch Netflix or something in the living room. Um, so yeah, I probably won't see you again, at least while I have them, you know, once I drop them off and they're gone back home, then I'll probably see you. It was funny. So I went to Fusakli's and got me uh, some chicken for lunch today. And I was pulling out my debit card from my little wristlet and it was full of sand. I don't know how that happened. I did like carry my wristlet on the beach yesterday with my mom, but it wasn't open. Like I have no idea how that happened. So, oh, all right. I'll see y'all in a couple days. Hello, good morning. Yeah, it's still morning. Happy Wednesday, y'all. So I am just editing this vlog and I wanted to include a little try on haul from a local oh. from a local boutique here in town called LNF Boutique. So they just recently, oh. for the for the first time ever, launched plus oh. size. So I jumped on board, got a few things. It's not okay, so my plan was I'm gonna do a separate, like dedicated haul on these items. And then they started selling out. And so I didn't want to, you know, I want you to be able to grab them if you want them. But I still wanted to show you. So some things are still available. I will link it all down below. I have two tops, a dress, and a really cute jumpsuit. I also got a face mask. So I posted about this boutique when I saw that they were doing plus size because their color scheme and just the whole vibe is that very like neutral colors. I don't know, I felt like it just really fit with my like new wardrobe idea in my head. I also got like a little note, thanks for shopping. I bought all this stuff myself, by the way. So it's not, no one sent me this. I didn't get a discount, anything like that. So first, I guess let's start with the mask. I love, 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 love the color. I'll put the name and size and price of everything I'm wearing down below. This I know came in several different shades. I love that it has the adjustable stuff on the side. Plus the color is just so pretty. Oh, it's got a piece of like a little wire there. I'll tighten them on the sides. It's funny that this is like fashion. Let me show you my new mask. All right, so there we go. I believe it's a linen mask. I feel like that's what, what sucked me in. Yeah, linen. Let's do tops first. I just put on a pair of my own jeans. Y'all ask about these all the time. They're from Rue 21. I love them. Okay, so this first top is this like raw hem edge pocket tee. I love the fit of it. These like raw hem details I really, really love. Sleeve length is really good. It is a bit of a curved hem, slightly on the side. I feel like the length is really good. It's also a tad bit longer in the back. I just think this is an easy throw on tee. I almost wore it with those green jeans that y'all know I have the other day, but I went with a white t-shirt instead. I feel like this didn't really match my green vibes, but it absolutely matches with just regular jeans. You could do like black bottoms, those um, cropped like pants I have from Target would be really cute with this. I just think overall it's an easy to style, super comfortable, but also very cute and trendy tee. Next one we have, you have seen before. So I've worn this and styled this in a Style Saturday video. It's this really pretty color, almost like muscle tee type top so it's made like this so you can see where it's stitched and it just sucks in the sleeves right there i think that's such a cute look and it's something different than just like a plain like basic tee love the color as well this fit is the same brand and same size as the other one but the style is just a little bit more snug obviously it's a little bit longer here's what it looks like from the back this one would be cute Maybe like front tucked 
or like tucked into some pants or something. I just think this sleeve style is so popular right now. I do wanna say about this top as well, I've seen a super similar one on Target's website. So if this one is not available in your size at this boutique, then I'll, well, I'll link the Target one down below anyways. And they have more colors as well. So I might, I might actually grab a couple of those. Next, we have this dress. I knew it was short just by looking at it on the model, but I wasn't sure how tall the model was either. So it's this really cute black, like cottony, feeling dress, love the v-neck in the front. It's a really comfy, cute fit. It does have, yeah, a bit of elastic right around here. It is very, very short though. I do like that tie in the back as well. So what I do, I say this a lot, what I do with like shorter dresses is I wear a pair of like bike shorts underneath. I just wanted to put some shoes on to see what it looks like. Yeah, it's it's a little bit too short for me, but I'll probably just put bike shorts on underneath it. It does have pockets. Like how cute is this? I also have a similar one from Target of all places, um, but it's not quite the same. Like this is softer. It has the longer sleeves. It has the V-neck. It's just, it's got pockets. Like the details are a little bit nicer with this one. So it, the Target one, however, is a little bit longer. So here we go. It's cute like as I'm looking at it in the mirror, but it's just very short. So I'd probably, like I said, just wear bike shorts underneath it. And last but certainly not least, we have this beauty. This is what I was most excited about, just seeing the like sneak peeks of their launch and stuff. This is the softest denim jumpsuit. I don't even know if denim is like the right name for this fabric. I know they call it, what did she call it? Vanilla, maybe on the website. It's a slightly cropped, like wide leg, full button up jumpsuit. The color is just so pretty. Just everything about it, it buttons. I just feel like, I feel kind of like a painter, but not in like a bad way. Yeah, this is just so cute. So I've seen them style this with sneakers, with dressier shoes, with all sorts of things. This one too is going fast. I don't think they have my size even left. I think there was, you know, I think there's a couple of the smaller sizes available. I also just noticed that my belt loop popped up. So I need to like stitch that back some way right there. Okay, so this is so cute. I wanna take a picture the way that they styled it was like, not styled it, but took a picture in front of like a bright colored door, I think. And I think that would be so fun. My mom has a bright blue front door and I wanna go over there and just like take my picture in front of her door. Oh, here's what it looks like from the back, by the way. All these pockets as well are like functional pockets everywhere. Okay. I also rolled this just to show you. You could do it long or rolled. So everything, I'll link it down below. Again, not everything is available in all sizes, but I have found a couple of alternatives on different websites that I will link below as well. Okay, so I'm gonna end the vlog here because it's Wednesday and I need to edit you so that you can watch this tomorrow. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to hit the subscribe button. Drop some comments, like some questions for my mom because like we weren't really prepared to have her in a video. So that way next time we do a video together, she can answer your questions. So yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.